Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Real Hustle Life. It's your girl, Nene. So, we're in the beauty salon today because last episode, I got into it. And the police was looking for me. I had to hide out at Los, one of those spots. And um, so, we switched it up. We went from black and now we got that good old fire red. Looking real hot. I love it. Brittany. Brittany, I paid you, right? Okay, because you're looking kind of... Look at me, kind of suspect, but yeah. So this is the new range. Y'all remember this from the last episode, one of my presents. And then in addition to the range, he also bought me that new house, guys. The one I was asking for. So it is beautiful. Like I mean, more than I could ever expect. And the driveway is huge. Fits all his cars and everything. So we're good to go. All right, well, we're gonna go ahead and make our way over to Losa's shop because Ruger let me know that um, he left the keys to the F550 in the shop, in the truck. So we gotta go ahead and uh, get over there and let dispatch know we're ready to take some work. We gotta take some work. We gotta pay, we gotta pay for some of this stuff we done bought. We're spending like, rich man money so here we are here we are pulling up to the shop I'm gonna go back well I was going back in but they need to fix this daggone door all right there she go honestly in real life like my real life I'd rather drive one of these than a flatbed any day I swear, I would lose the company major amounts of money on a flatbed. But I think I can handle her. She nice and petite. And I look cute in it. This is dispatch. Come in. Dang, dispatch, you didn't even give me a minute. Go ahead, what's up? We got a car parked illegally. Can you bring it in? Roger that, dispatch. We got it. 10-4. We on our way out. Let's go, guys. All right, first job of the day. I'm excited. Let's get it. Hope I don't crash. I hope people are not in their cars doing crazy stuff and trying to fight me and whatnot because I will pull out my pistols so quick. They just won't even, they won't even know what hit them. I'm trying to tell you. It's gonna go down if it has to go down and I mean like people you know you just shouldn't park illegally like I don't know where you're parked but if you're not supposed to be there don't be there otherwise it's my job to come and hook and book them get them out of there I got money to make and I don't got time for nobody in ABS I'm trying to tell you it should be close though. Yeah, like, I'm gonna make this left up here and we should see an illegally parked car somewhere up here. On the back. Probably in this building parking lot. I do see a car. Hold on, hold on, sir. Yep, there we go. Parked in the handicap. You know you wrong, parking in the handicap. All these empty spots around here. Well, sorry for you. Come on down to the impound and pick up your ride, as long as you got the money. And we're out. Hey, get away oh, from my car! Hold on. Hey, oh, oh, sir, are you crazy? Oh, time to take out the pistol. You haven't now thought you was taking your car man i can't believe him like he actually just yanked me out of the truck like a rag doll and thought he was going to get away with it not today buddy dang sir did you just bump into the back of me like that i better not get no money deducted I know y'all saw that right. 
that car came up mm -hmm. on the side, swiped the, swipe my toe. Oh gosh, you see this? <laughs> this is crazy. Man, let me hurry up and get this car to the final destination. I need a break already. Like my anxiety level has increased by like a thousand. Yeah. So. All right, cool. We're almost here. About to pull up and drop this car off. I, I'm telling you, I might have to switch up professions for a second. Who is she talking to? <laughs> she must be having a bad day. Arms going off. Yeah, I might gotta get back to what I know. Wrapping. All right, that's what's up. We got $500 for that tow. And they didn't take off for any property damage. So that's what's up, because that dude definitely slammed up into the back of us like he was nuts. I can't do it anymore. I'm gonna go sell some drugs because it's funner. Yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do. Plus, we end up making more money. Like, I just only made $500. All that work. Some man put his hands, beat me up. Like, terribly, man. I had to escape from the police. Like, just too much went on for $500. So we're gonna go up here to this, like, um, probably this little storage unit place up here. Cause it's got a big open, parking lot so everybody can practice their social distancing and dispatch what's up matter of fact hold on dispatch i got work to do all right man i'm out here i'm on the block come on send him my way See who we got today. <laughs> My butt looking real good in these pants. I think I'm gonna have to order like all the flavors. Here they come. Peace to you. Hey, peace to you, brother. What's up? God bless you. Just hey. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> What's up? I don't even like how you started off. What's I don't. <laughs> Take your drugs, ma'am. Yeah, okay. Now, Shit. say it again. Uh, Get down. You want some more? What you want some more? Get on the floor. Honey. What? What? You, oh, you brought your twin? You brought your sister? What you wanted to? I told you don't get back up. What you wanted to? Oh, why? Right. That's. Drama. I know. All right, girl. Well, get your sister. What's good? Nothing. What's up, man? Thanks. And be careful. Oh, bump it into my truck like What's that. Up? What's up, man? What's up? What you need? We gotta hurry up. Let's go. I got things to do. Yep. Hey, homie. What's up? What you need? I got whatever you need. All right, my man. All right, my man. Well, that was enough drama for the day. Hey, what's up? Made it out alive. What's up? Come on, I gotta go. Oh, you know what? See? I spoke too fast. I'm gonna take out my strap. Where they at? I'm about to bust off like that president. About to be Scarface out this joint in the last scene. Taking all of y'all out. Messing up my hair and my little cute pants. They white. All right, guys, we gotta go. Now we got the police on us. They not dead. Oh, 
Yeah, we gotta go. <laughs> and we out. Find a spot to hide at, cause this is crazy. All right, guys, we made it out alive. Thank God for the trap house. So, um, I think we're gonna take one more. I think we have time. Anyone got ears? Hey, what's, go ahead, dispatch. We need a car cleared from the train tracks. All right, I'm on it, I'm on it. This is gonna be the last job for the night, guys. I can't deal with any more. We've been into too, we just been into too much today. Like, I keep on having to take my gun out and show these people that they can't play with me. I'm really cute and I'm light skinned, but I hold it down, so. Anyway, let me go ahead and fuel up because we still got a little bit of time left on the clock. And, you know, we don't want to get there and end up needing a tow truck with the tow truck. So let's take care of this and be on our way. We got to go pick up this stalled car from the train tracks before it causes a catastrophe. We don't want that. That kind of like reminds me of a movie I used to be obsessed with when I was a kid. And we're almost there, so I'm gonna make it quick. But um, it was fried green tomatoes. Oh my gosh. Uh, the first part of the movie like killed me. Anyway, a little kid got stuck on the train tracks and ended up dying, but. Uh, so let me get this car up out of here. So everybody can get back to business as usual. All right, got us safely moved up out the way. Ma'am, you need a ride? Come on, get up in here. <laughs> Why are you in the car anyway? Get Walk around the car, ma'am. Walk around the truck. Okay. Get on in here. Well, that was not fun. Is there a repair shop here you can drop me at? Yeah, I got you. Can we please get there in one piece? Ma'am, I'm gonna need you to relax. So I'm just ready to tell you that we're on our way there and we're gonna get there safely, calm down. Okay. You know what, let me go ahead and turn the volume up on the music because <laughs> this lady's gonna make me flip out and I need to keep my composure stressed out I think that next time y'all see me I'm gonna be in a spa or on an island somewhere chilling this is crazy I know we're supposed to be saving and all that but I think I'm gonna go ahead and take my share my share of the money that I made today <laughs> and we're going on a VK I did way too much today. So I'm gonna go ahead and drop this lady off over here at Odo's Auto Parts so she can get her car fixed. And get on with her life. Thank you. You're welcome. Hopefully I can get this before he finds out. I hope you should. That's what I'm saying about this tow truck. I hope I can get it fixed before he find out. Oh, oh I'm sorry. Ma'am, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's already damaged anyway, so. Just blame it on the other crash. Let me get out of here. All right. I can't complain, you know? We made a, a okay, About what? I'm going home, sir. <sighs> Gosh. It's been too I think something is wrong with this tire. What y'all think? You think this tire is okay? Who drives a tow truck with low profile wheels? <laughs> we do. Oh, dang, dang. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Uh, gosh. Nobody. I don't even have a tire. I'm out. I'm going in for the day. I'm not doing no more work. Y'all gonna have to check me out on an island somewhere next episode because this is just too much. I know I'm supposed to be saving money, but can't save money when <laughs> when I'm doing donuts in the middle of the street. 
so there goes our green but we did make we did make more money trapping anyway plus i'm just not big on manual labor it is what it is it is what it is oh oh my god i am so sorry it's been a long day all right i didn't see you let me go ahead and park this car because there. Gotta go dispatch. I'm out of here. Somebody else is gonna have to pick that one up. I am dying. So, hey, <laughs> the day is over with. I'm done. I am done. I'm going in here. I'm gonna return these keys and I'm out of here. I gotta go take a shower. I need to get up out of these clothes. Gosh. Sweating my hair out. So, I might just make an appointment and go see Brittany again. But don't forget to subscribe. Hit the like button. Don't hesitate to comment. Be kind to each other, guys. And until next time. Mwah.